Are you guys ready for another video? Here is a tutorial for a fun cartoon fish. Have a good time. Hey kids. So we are going to learn how to do an angler cartoon fish um, inspired by my grandson, Jacob. These are two I just did. Um, I'm going to start with basic shapes. So just get your pencils out and watch the steps. So to do a fish, to start, what I would do is a bump, almost like a hill. And we want to draw super light because there's parts of it we want to erase. And if we press too hard, we won't be able to get rid of the line. So go ahead and just make a hill. Doesn't have to be perfect. Um, and then once you've done that, what I would do is start over to the left and you just make, make a line. And if you want, you could go up or down, depending on, that's the back side of his mouth. And then go ahead and bring another shape coming this way. So now you got your basic shape of your fish. Um, the next thing I would do is up here, draw a circle. And you'll want to erase inside. This will be his eyeball. Now, a lot of times what I'll do is I'll give him an eyelid, sort of. You can go and do a parallel line going along the edge of the circle. And then figure out where you want his eyeball. Maybe it's here. Right, next thing is his fins. So I, I don't know, you can do an S shape like this. You could also just have it fan out. It's up to you. Now they're sort of very skinny sort of S shape. And then bring it down and swoop it in like that. Then I add a little fin there. And fin here. That's a basic fun fish. Make it an angler fish. Angler fish. Now, if I would have started it lower on my page, I'd probably have a little bit more room to make it curve up. But since I didn't, I'm just going to start this coming down. Now, there are a lot of these same shapes are used over and over. And go skinnier as you get to the top. And then a circle because he's got a little light bulb. And that's your basic shape. Now, what I would do here is do really skinny. Another kind of a, another shape like you did here, but not so much. And do maybe four of these pointy, very skinny triangles. Now, next thing you wanna do is do a swoop coming down. Boy, we use that shape a lot. And last but not least, you want to do some teeth. And you can make them pointy and you can make them bigger than I'm making them. I usually start big and they get smaller. They kind of look like um, the back tail of a, or the dorsal fin of a shark. <laughs> then you can add a little detail to your fins. Some lines, if you like. And that's basically how you do it. The next step is outlining with a black Sharpie. And then color. <laughs> Thank you.
what you want to do is take a darker color to add some shadows to give it a little depth. And that's what we're doing. Happy drawing. Have a great day.